invite my I'm trying to think of how the whole thing started. I think uh, it goes back to January, February 2012 and the Vehicle Parking District, which owns the building at 400 West 2nd Street, um, approached me and I'm commissioner for the city, for the Cultural Arts Commission, and wanted to know if I knew of an artist that would be interested in doing a mural on the side of the building. And it comes pretty much on the heels of the Pomona Cultural Arts Commission writing and passing with the city council a new public art ordinance. So it was exciting that the city actually was interested in doing a project. We got a phone call from David Flores and he had recently been in Pomona and had looked around at some of the spaces and some of the walls that were available and was excited about maybe doing something. And he came up with a couple of proposals, all of which were great, but weren't quite what we were looking for as far as being something that celebrated the uh, unique history of the Inland Empire. We decided that we thought maybe Carl Benjamin would be a good choice. So before we pursued that, I wanted to talk to Carl directly. And so I had lunch with him one day and his family and showed him the drawings and he was thrilled and loved David's sketches, loved the idea that the styles were so complementary to each other and he chose the drawing. After Carl initially saw the drawings and was excited about the complementary styles of his work and David Flores' work, we took the drawings to the Cultural Arts Commission, which is part of the process of the new ordinance. And of course, all the commissioners loved the idea. They loved the fact that it was on a public building in the city of Pomona and that it celebrated a regional artist that was so important. Once we had that, it also went to the Vehicle Parking District, who owns the building, and also planning took a look at it. Well, these caps are. This is kind of a stock cab, this orange uh, gold cab. It's like the one they come with. It's pretty medium use. This dark green cap is pretty good for sharp lines. These lime ones are fat caps. Pink dots, they go real big, real wide. They disperse the can pretty quickly. Each one does a different thing. Each color does something else. Some fan, some flare, some fill. decided that we would have it done in April of 2012 and unfortunately, well fortunately for David Flores, he was commissioned to do multiple murals for the Olympics but unfortunately for us, it took him out of the running to getting the mural done in April. So we had to wait until he was finished with the Olympics and, and then when he came back we started a mural and another set of strange timing. Carl became ill and we didn't really get to have the mural finished before he passed away, but he did know that it was started and did let his family know that he was happy about that. Then there's eyes on kids. What up? Day, end of day two, production on the Benjamin, uh, Carl Benjamin mural. Sorry, my brain's kind of fried sitting here all day long. But we're wrapping up the hand, about to finish this thing up. Tomorrow we're going to start the pattern on the wall. So that's right now, Pomona Arts District, Pomona Arts Commission. Pomona Arts this is Pomona. Anthony Martinez. I'm David Flores. We're, this is my boom operator. You can't paint without a boom operator. You can't do it. You need this guy. This is like the best boom operator like money can't buy, right? Money can't buy. mural is especially poignant because it's on the outside of the building that my husband and I live in, um, Alex Kallenberg, he's a painter. Carl was a mentor and a teacher and a friend and he was very close like family to us and so for Alex to have this 
big mural of his mentor on the building. It's, it feels like you know he's right here, and he's supporting us and he's supporting Alex. So I think Alex was emotional about it and I'm glad that we have it on the building. And I think it'll serve some inspiration for a lot of artwork to come. Yeah, you're an But please just call me that Just call me that Cause I understand, I really understand what you mean If you play some silent thing I might, I might, I might Figure out what you're trying to say And there's only so many hours in the day So please just be my friend And tell me if you're not <laughs> Well, you can drive me You can drive me But who's gonna bring me